Well, chances are, you know, when you flush the toilet, you don't give much thought about where all that goes. No, but the Little Rock Water Reclamation Authority wants to change all of that. So tonight, Dawn Scott verifies why something that is often flushed really shouldn't be. We have to be mindful of what we're putting down the drain. That's Walter Collins, Director of Operations and Facilities for Little Rock Water Reclamation Authority. He knows about flushing. Right now, the big concern are the wipes. He's talking about those flushable wipes. They sound pretty self-explanatory, so of course we flush them out of sight, out of mind. But Collins warns the flush is just the beginning of a wipe's life in the sewage system. They say flushable, uh, and that's kind of a, a misconception. Again, uh, a plastic toy is flushable. It's not biodegradable. It, it's not intended to go down the sewer system. Toilet paper is made to break down. If you ever put it into a, a, a glass jar and you stir it, toilet paper will actually disintegrate into fine particles, and that we can treat. Wipes, flushable or otherwise, are clogging up water treatment machinery across the globe. This is the mess in California last year, a giant mound of wipes clogging pipes. If it makes it past the homeowner, it gets into the neighborhood, the collection systems, uh, it can bind and clog the pipes there that cause overflows. The United Kingdom is considering a countrywide ban on all wet wipes after Water UK found they caused 93% of all sewer blockages. So we could verify flushable wipes can be flushed, but we can also verify they can cause major problems for sewer systems. The experts tell us stick to plain old TP. People see it as a convenience, a way to dispose of something. Uh, it really needs to go to a trash can and ultimately to a landfill. The Little Rock Water Reclamation Authority actually just launched the Don't Flush That campaign, hoping to stop people from flushing the wrong things. And you can read more about the campaign now on our website, THV11.com. Hey, if you have something you'd like us to verify, email us, verify at THV11.com or reach out on social media. That's THV11.com. All right.